Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing the budget update for the first week of June. So uh, let's go, let's just get right into it. We're gonna start with the expenses as usual. So this week we had 43.17 go into groceries, 19.06 into spending, 44.80 in dine out, 20 in birthdays, 300 in rent, 74 in health, 60, 74 in gas, 340 in miscellaneous and 3614 in beauty so that was 601 euros and 31 cents perfect so let's go and switch to the weekly budget layout we're gonna do the actual expenses and we'll see any rollover if i if we have it, so the paycheck was 350 the rollover was 12 so 362 to work with for the week groceries we budgeted 50 we have a rollover of five and six so that means we spent 44 spending we budgeted 20 and we have a rollover of one so that was 19 and dine out has a rollover of five we budgeted 50, so we spent 45 in there. Gas got five. Oh my God, my nail is dirty. I'm sorry for that. Utilities got 25, miscellaneous five, and one month ahead, 50. So in total for cash envelopes and bills, that was 193. So 362 minus 193, 169. So we're bringing that up here to short-term sinking funds. Beauty, Christmas, and birthdays all got a 10. So did health. Subscriptions got five and travel got 15. So that was 60 in total. 169 minus 60 was 19. 109 in long-term sinking funds. Car got five, deposit 25. Beds got 10, retirement 20, that was 60. So 109 minus 60 was 49. So we're bringing that here to the savings. So we did stuff 37, which was 25 plus 12. So 49 minus 37 is 12. So we should have five, 10, 11, 12 euros left over. Perfect. So we're going to stuff these 12 uh, with the next paycheck. So that's 49 and zero euros left to budget. Let me quickly find my cheat sheet for uh, next week and we can set up the budget. So we will have paycheck number two of 300 euros and then the rollover money we have here, which is going to be 12 euros. So 312 in total. So groceries will be getting 40, spending 20, dine out 50. Rent will be getting 50 and upkeep uh, or one month ahead will get a 10. So in total, 40 plus 20 plus 50 plus 50 plus 10 is 170. So I do have uh, less money to work with than usual as I explained in my last week's videos. I did quit my job, so I have to spread my budget a little thinner. So that's why there's a lot of envelopes we're not stuffing or we just have less amounts that we usually do so short-term sinking funds birthdays is going to get 10 christmas 10 clothing 5 and travel 15 so that's 5 15 40 euros so 142 minus 40 is 102 we're bringing that down here to long-term sinking funds we have 25 going into deposit we have five going into pets 15 in retirement and five in technology and weddings. So in total for long-term sinking funds, we have 55. So we have 102 minus 55 is 47. So 47, we have 35 allocated from the paycheck plus the 12 we have of the rollover, which is 47 going in to the same challenges in tomorrow's video so that was a very quick um very thorough uh, layout for next week's budget i am going on a trip uh later today so i'm pre-filming these videos i will probably film a travel vlog as well so yeah very excited for that i will also have some travel spending for next week and we're gonna go all through that uh once it's time but that was all for today's video i'm going to be back tomorrow with a cash stuffing of this paycheck so make sure to tune in for that 
that. But in the meanwhile, I wish you a very wonderful day, morning, evening, wherever you are. And I hope to see you next time. Bye.